All right, so we have a clamp meter um, on here. And I got this over a, a name brand one. I mean, oh, is this name brand? I'm going to say it isn't. You can say it is if you want. I'm going to say it isn't. However, it looks like the same features as the name brand one. And that name would be, I don't know, maybe I'll, I'll put it right here. Or maybe I'll put it over here on top of my finger. Um, this had a coupon to get, is it $20 off or something? I don't know. It had a coupon, Amazon coupon to get money off. And it came out $20 cheaper than the name brand one that I have up here somewhere or something. I don't know. Yes, my fingers are dirty. Deal with it. Actually, they're not dirty. Well, they are just dug in dirt. However, the black is dye from black mulch. Deal with it. Ooh, look at this pretty case. Oh, I already like this one better than the main brand one. All right, this is a shell case. Shell case until you get it wet, you know? Uh. Oh, yeah. God damn, I'm having a hard time holding this damn phone. Ooh, it comes with batteries and shit. And I mainly got this for the clamp, the AC clamping. Um, if you don't need AC clamping, uh, amp amperage clamp. Um, sorry, not AC, DC. DC uh, clamp, AC amp clamp. That's the main reason I got this. Only the more expensive ones have that. I needed that I wanted to use that for the car to do um to check uh, parasitic drains and stuff check the parasitic drains oh, I got some needle points on those puppies things too oh there you go interesting all right kind of sucks this isn't using an 18650 i mean you got enough room you got three four and a half volt i mean why not why not use an 18650 i might get pissed enough and Drill this out and put an 18650 in there. Depending on, I mean, this is awfully. What is this? What is this, thing? What is this thing? Why is there so much room in there? All right. It's got a flashlight on it. Well, let me let me uh, get those batteries in there first. I just did a direct wire and taped it to the back. Yeah, so, that's nice. So they got to go this way. So blind people, blind people, there you would never know which way to put that in. So positive is positive up is the middle one. That's so awesome. I 
have an AC clamp, don't I? And it's detecting the... Uh, that's, that's already not good. How are you detect, detecting current? This better not be garbage. Because when you're detecting parasitic current, you need to know milliamps. And this thing can't be telling me. There's a light. Maybe they need to zero it out. AC. Where's AC amps? Oh. No, we're on AC. Oh, zero. Oh, there we go. There we go, buddy. Okay. I zero it again. All right. Okay, let's get a real. think right. so let's get this turned on and start charging the battery start charging the phone so Even work for AC. Well, this is on drawn current. Well, why are we at zero? Well, it appears to work in the car, although it's been sitting at 200 milliamps for a while now. Um, I might buy the name brand one and see if that's more sensitive, because current's current. Let's see, we'll turn on the parking lights. All right, six and a half amp. Seems a lot of current for for just parking lights. Let's, let's see these. And then we'll
will go to now these are the the halogen not halogen um what are they called uh they're 55 watt so now we're at 15 amps 15 15 amps uh hid those are hid 35 watt hids i believe so See. 70 divided by 12 that's only six amps why is that oh six plus the other six so 12 so i really should get i should get leds for these because those things draw a lot of current huh so six about seven about seven amps for the hids for the hids and about six for the parking front back you know, so six and a half it's kind of crazy that, that all those parking lights that that's the why you want led i got these high powered hids and they're using the same current as the freaking stupid ass parking lights Plus the doors open and all that shit. Oh, so the doors open, so we get one and a half amp. All right, so one, 1 1.2 amp is because the interior lights are on. Oh, those those are all LED. Yeah, I changed those over to all LED. So I don't know how good this is going to be for trickle charging. I'd have to wait till the car goes to sleep to see if that 200 milliamp goes away. See how it's dropping now that I close the door and it drops down to 200 milliamp. Now I do have this zeroed. You see zero is selected. Of course you're going to wind that it's upside down. Not my problem. You see the zero. Your brain sees the zero. So try you try seeing the zero. But it's bouncing, baby. All right. <sighs> I might buy the more expensive one and see if it can read the current going through these because that's just which doesn't make sense it says it doesn't see current going through oh that's the starter that's that's why it doesn't see current here this is the starter that goes down That's where the starter is down there so this is the that's the starter cable that's why there's no current on this this is accessories and the rest of the car didn't do it that time oh yeah that was a, yeah i don't think so dude 